Coach, nothing really felt easy with, with, with this one, right? But how did you, I guess, overcome kind of the scrappiness that Memphis was playing with? Uh, I mean, we talked about it pregame, you know what I mean? Like, give them a ton of credit. That's who they are, uh, no matter who's on the floor for them. Um, you know, they play with that competitive spirit and they keep fighting, keep coming. Um, but again, I thought our guys did a great job of just showing resolve. Um, and, you know, obviously we were much better in the second half. Um, you know, our defense is what makes us. And we held them to 22 points and 21 points. Um, and that's what obviously gave us, you know, the advantage and the ability to go uh, get the win. But again, we, we've got the ability. Um, you know, so even when things aren't as pretty as we would like, uh, we know we can go there, and then we get guys that can create uh, and come up with buckets when we need them. It felt like you guys were kind of searching for a spark, too, in that second half. How did Karras help provide that? I mean, that's, that's what he does. You know, I mean, he's a, he's a guy who can just get it going uh, and can contribute on both ends. You know, he gets steals, pushes it in transition. Offensively, he pushes, he attacks, he makes plays happen. Uh, and it seemed like he just continues to make timely shots. Um, you know, when we need him most, he's there in the moment and makes the big ones. Donovan officially selected as an all-star reserve tonight before the game. Can you just take a moment to reflect on how all the work that a guy like that puts in can culminate to you know this moment of fifth consecutive all-star? I mean, he, he's a superstar, and I don't think there's any question uh, about that. Um, you know, if. In my opinion, if it wasn't, <laughs> you know, if it wasn't a popularity contest, he should be a starter. Um, you know, that's not a knock on the other guys that are because obviously they're elite and there's only five of those spots. But uh, you know, you're hard pressed to find a guy um, positionally who plays the game better than Donovan does, um, and how important he is to us all over the floor. Uh, you know, it's not just the ability to create and carry a game, but you know, like we've talked about his ability to make his teammates better, have empathy for his teammates, understanding when they need the ball, how to create for them, uh, and to lead them. So, um, you know, he's a superstar, um, and he continues to prove it every night. Uh, <coughs> Coach, any update uh, on Jarrett, and how do you think uh, your other guys did, especially T. Jones uh, filling in without him and Evan tonight? Uh, I thought he did a really good job. I mean, I think he was great defensively, you know, had some really big blocks for us. Uh, took a challenge, you know, in guarding Jaron Jackson, uh, which isn't easy. Um, but I thought he did a really good job filling in in those minutes, and I don't have an update on uh, Jared yet for you. And then uh, you mentioned earlier, but how, what happened in that third quarter where you really turned up the defense? Yeah, I mean, that was it. It was a decision that was made. Um, you know, again, you play last night, you travel. You know, you're trying to kind of figure out, you know, uh, your wits a little bit um, and just try to find the rhythm of the game. And, you know, what we did was found the rhythm of the game for us on the defensive end of the floor and allowed that to spark our offense, create easy opportunities for us. But, uh, you know, this game is going to be a grind out when you play the Grizzlies. You know what I mean? Like they slow the game down. They're big. They're physical. Uh, they're active. Um, so they're going to make it a, you know, a grimy game. And you just got to figure out, you know, your how. And tonight our defense was our how. And then uh, DG, second night of back-to-back, -back, how do you think he looked? I thought he was good again. Um, you know, it's, it's tough those limited minutes for a guy who's used to playing uh, in bulk, trying to figure out and pick your spots. But uh, I thought he was a big part of our push in that, um, you know, fourth quarter to get us kind of uh, settled. You know, you hate to have to kind of take him out of that moment. But, um, you know, I thought he did a great job kind of finding his footing and helping us push the lead. Thanks.